have a heart of light. Therefore, I do not fear the darkness. Hey guys, what's up? So before we try another Silvana build, I just wanted to show you guys how our second skill works. Her second skill is called Spiral Strangling and it hits enemies in a direction for 6 times. This is similar to Leomord's first skill where they both gain shield while casting. The skill can be cancelled by moving. The enemies within the skill are slightly pulled to the center. If the enemy is at the tip of the skill, they will be pulled. If they are near Silvana, they will be pushed away from her. It has no slow effect but it can be used the to slow down a target because of the pull effect. The skill can only deal 75% damage on minion. Normally it can only hit 6 Lord times people, but if I you add attack speed down. stats, the number of hits will increase. Here is a simple test. This is the normal 6 hits. If you want peace, prepare for war. Let's add Wind Talker to increase her attack speed. My faith is rock solid. That's 7 hits. Let's add another For Wind Talker. I shall never back down. Eight hits with two wind towers. Yet Let's Empire add two more wind towers. If you want peace, That's nine hits. Nine hits more. is the limit. Adding more attack speed will no longer increase the My number of hits. Is rock solid. My dear brother! When she hits level 14, her skill will be able to do 7 hits. It's because of her attack speed growth. She can do 7 hits even without any attack speed item when she reaches level 14. So, will a full attack speed build work on her? It's a bit tricky because of her ultimate. When she uses her ultimate, she already gains 100 attack speed. Here she is with just 20% attack speed. She can already do 9 hits you, if she combines brother. her ultimate and second skill. I'm a bit skeptical with using more than one attack speed item. Why not just increase her magic power instead of aiming for that extra hit? Adding magic power will also increase her shield and overall damage. And with the use of her ultimate, she can easily reach the limit on the number of hits. Anyway, we will still try different Sylvana builds to see which one is the most effective. What about you guys? What build do you think will fit the upcoming new hero, Sylvana? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.